today I'm working with Voodoo on uh, some self-control issues. You can see she's really excited about what I have. And she uh, usually will jump up and down. Sometimes she'll get a little asthma attack from all the excitement. What I'm trying to work with is her being able to understand that if she's calm and does the right thing, that she'll get what she wants faster. It's a, a combination of... Uh, of eye contact, leave it, oh see, she knows that one, and some other little tricks that we've been working on to accomplish this. The first thing I'm going to do, see I have exactly what she wants here, a treat. I'm going to hold it in front of her. She's going to, it's good that she's interested in it, but uh, I'm going to close my hand so she can't get it when she tries to get close to it. And right now she's searching for an alternative because she doesn't quite uh, know the game. But I'm going to get her started with one that she knows, which is sit. Come here. Sit. Yes. Now she knows the game started. And then I'm willing to start giving her these treats. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to keep it out. Oh. And keep my hand closed until she does the right thing, which is look me in the eye. She's going to go through every trick she knows until she does the right one. And that's eye contact. Yes. And so now she knows the reward's going to come from eye contact and sitting. Hey, right now she's chosen to lay, which is fine. Right now as long as she... Yes. As long as she's making eye contact with me in a calm manner, she'll get her treat. Now I'm going to tempt her by holding it out so she can grab it. She thinks it's an invitation. Yes. And that at first, I'm going to use a, another trick that she's already learned, which is leave it. Leave it. Yes. We're going to reinforce that one. We're going to work our way up until she has a little more endurance in behaving before she gets it. Yes. Now, I use the... Uh, Allure and clicker training. Yes. And I don't have a clicker, so I'm using my word, which is yes. And she is conditioned to know that's a good thing. Leave it. Now we'll wait for eye contact. Yes. Now I'm only using my keyword leave it right now because she knows and understands that. Yes. And you see, just by just taking a little time with her, she's already starting to catch on. She's calmer. I'm going to bring her forward a little bit more. And tempt her. Leave it. Yes. And really, you just want to build this positive reinforcement. Yes. She knows that's where the treats are coming from. And the more you do this, I'm going to let her be distracted. Wait for eye contact. Yes. As soon as I know she's listening to me and being calm, that's where the jackpot comes from. And really all it takes is to do this a couple times. Get up in the morning when your dog's ready for breakfast. And she knows that word too, obviously. Breakfast. Mm-hmm. And when they're hungry and they're looking for their breakfast, that's a really good time to like get some nibbles out or uh, one of their treats and break it up in little pieces. And you see she's trying to find some. I don't have them, but she's still going to be good because she knows that that's where the treats come from. And that's one way that you can teach your dog to um, some self-control. And that's really what this exercise is all about.